Hey, what's up guys? Glock9 here and welcome back to Ark. The first thing I want to do this morning is pop open the smithy. Last night I crafted another dinosaur behemoth gateway and a gate. So I'm going to bring both of those things over to our inventory and the rest of this shit, the oil, the crystal, the spark powder, cementing paste and metal are all the things we're going to need to craft a fabricator. So let's get that thing moving and we'll put it down before we leave. There we go. Bring it down to our tool belt. And let's throw it against this wall here. We'll get it as close to the wall as possible. That looks good. Now, the first thing I want to craft out of this thing is uh, this bad boy right here, the pump action shotgun. Now, we have the cementing paste and we have the metal, but we don't have enough polymer. So, we got to get some more of that. But we can use organic polymer. So that means we gotta go beat the shit out of some more penguins. Now last night, I also got a little bit of gasoline moving in the forge. That just takes oil and hide. And you smelt it down in the forge and you get gasoline, which you need to run the fabricator. So I'm gonna throw that in the fabricator for now. But we need more oil, so we're after that today as well. But before we do any of that shit, let's put in this other gateway. I think that looks good right about there. Bam. Let's see how it looks from over here. Just make sure there's no gaps or anything. Yeah, that looks good. And now from this point, I'm just going to continue on using gateways all the way down the beach to the stone wall there. And we'll be nice and secure in our backyard. Let's put the gate in now. Pow. All right. Starting to come together. Pretty soon we'll be uh, nice and safe back here. We won't have to worry about wandering dinosaurs that want to start some shit. Now let's get out of here. First place we are going is not to beat the shit out of penguins. The first place we are going is actually something that was recommended by one of you guys in the last episode. I thought it was a great idea. Basically, we are headed to the volcano to uh, put down a couple of forges. And we're just going to mine metal up there. Because there's a bunch of metal rocks up there. And we're going to just smelt it down in a couple of forges on the volcano. And bring back the metal as we need it. This way, we don't have to go get metal, come back home, smelt it down, go get metal, come back home, smelt it down. We can just keep fucking dumping the shit in the forges up there, and then as the metal is uh, refined, we can bring it back home as we need it. This area right here looks good. It's nice and open, easy to spot. There's plenty of metal rocks around. And let's put the forges on top of this area right here. Seems nice and safe. Let's park Dora right here here for now. Nope. Dora up here. There we go. And let's throw these foundations down right here. I brought two foundations with me as well because you can't just put forges down on the ground. Gotta put them on a foundation. Let's bring these down now. One. And two. Sweet. Now let's go get some metal. Throw half of it in here, the other half in here, and let's go get some more. We're going to have to get some wood also, so we can light the fires. I didn't bring any wood with me. All right, and already we have over 150 pieces in each forge. That's beautiful. Let's go find some more, and uh, like I said, grab some wood as well. Oh, we got a dodo up here. And this little guy, I think he's pretty chill. He's not going to bother us. Ah, this flying ant is, though. Fuck out of here. Give me your chitin', bitch. We might be too heavy here. Yep. That's all right. I think we can get there on foot with no problems. You follow me, Dora. Yeah, here we go. Ah, some more ants. Basically free chitin' walking around. Alright, I think that's pretty good. I mean, we could throw more metal in. Where's Dora? Down here still? Yep. What's that little guy doing? Ow. I don't trust this little fucker. 
Let's just get out of here. There's plenty of metal smothering down in those forges. When we come back to pick up the metal bars, we'll harvest more metal and throw that in the forges. For now, let's go beat the shit out of some penguins. Got an explore note down here. Let's grab this shit real quick. All right, that was good. Crazy fucking Spino down there trying to eat me though, but we're fine. Let's go ahead and uh, spend this level. Two of them. We'll go stamina and wait. Look at this crazy shit. Oh, he's gonna push him down the cliff. That's hilarious. Man, it's a little wild over here. Definitely not as safe as it was the last time. Got a pack of wolves over here, and the wolves are hunting the penguins. That's not good. That's my polymer. Goddamn wolves. Oh, they're going after that mammoth right now. There's a couple of penguins over here. And oh, look at this. Got another explorer note. Let's grab this shit. Alright, we're nice and safe up here for a second. Six levels. Let's go. Wait, wait, wait. Stamina, stamina, health. Alright. Now, what does it look like down here? Hard to tell. Here, I got a level two. Let's go, um... Stamina. Well, let's cruise down and see. Oh, the wolves are right here. Yeah, they've eaten all the penguins. I think we have to find a better spot. This shit's cleared out over here and just too damn dangerous. Oh, here we go. Yeah, there's some penguins. And this should be some nice, easy, safe kills. We got another level for Dora. Let's go wait again. And let's get some polymer. Ah, oh, there goes our club. All right, I'll finish harvesting this guy with the hatchet, but then we gotta go find some wood and fiber in order to repair this club. Ah, well, it's way too fucking crazy over here. Yeah, I'm good on all that. Now, let's go right down here. This should work. There's some fiber and some wood. Oh, shit, and another fucking, uh... Explore note. Let's grab this shit. We're going wait, wait. Stamina, stamina, wait. Alright, let's fill up our water skin since I just drank it. And then we'll kill a few more penguins. Hey, Mr. Penguin, I got a riddle for you. What's black, white, and red all over? You give up? It's you! Ah, there goes our club again. Alright, we'll use the hatchet. And we'll just get out of here. I think we got enough polymer for today. Ah, home sweet home. What's up, everyone? I'm back. All right, first things first. Let's get this shotgun crafted. Whoops. I did not mean to turn that on. I meant to open up the inventory. Let's put in the polymer. How much do we need again? 55. Let's just throw 60 in there. And then we need the cementing paste and the metal. Which I have right in here. Metal. Uh, cementing paste. Throw that shit in there. And, uh, I think I gotta turn it on first. There we go. Sweet. Alright, to make the shotgun ammo, we need gunpowder, metal, and simple bullets. To make the simple bullets, we need gunpowder and metal. Now, we don't have much metal left, but I'll take what we have, along with gunpowder. Craft as many of those simple bullets as we can. Then we're gonna have to take a trip back to the volcano and get some more metal. Okay, 26 simple bullets we were able to craft, but we have zero metal left. At least I think we have zero metal, right? Yeah, none in there. 
None in there. Okay, well, like I said, we gotta go back to the volcano. Might as well leave this shotgun here. It's pretty useless without any ammo. Let's throw half the metal in here. The other half in here. And let's grab uh, all the metal bars. 69 out of this forge. And 69 out of this forge. Double 69, Dora. That's got to be a good omen. All right, let's get the metal into the smithy. Craft as much uh, shotgun ammo as we can. And then we're going to need to make more simple bullets. And we're going to need more gunpowder. Got plenty of that. Whoops, not in there, in here. And we can make more gunpowder as well. All right, that'll do. 54 shells, I think that's good for now. Let's throw the gunpowder in here. And the metal in here. And let's put the club away, bring down the shotgun. Fuck yeah. All right, we are off to the coastline again to murder some more trilobites for the oil. We'll get some more chit and do, which is great, and I think you also get those silica pearls from them occasionally. But uh, like I said, we're mostly after the oil, so we can make some more gasoline for the fabricator. And then when we get back home, we're gonna do some work on the base, and that'll probably be it for today. Well, the shotgun works. Hey, Dodo. Oh, good lord. It's devastating. Oh, <laughs> Alright. I better stop. This is too much fun. I don't want to waste all the ammo. Killing dodos. <laughs> Let's uh, go find some trilobites. I usually have a little bit more luck finding them uh, on the southern part of the island. So let's start heading in that direction. Might as well check this real quick. See if we got anything interesting. What's this? Uh, blueprint for a water jar. That's cool. And the blueprint for a journeyman ghillie mask. Oh, nice. We already have the ghillie boots and the ghillie... Uh, what the hell is that? Is that just part of the obelisk? Or can we go in there? I have no idea. Well, let's stick to the mission. Uh, but what was I saying? Oh, the ghillie suit. We already have the ghillie uh, boots and the ghillie pants, I believe. We can craft the mask now. Then we just need the shirt. We'll be all ghillied out. On oh, the gloves, right? We need gloves, too. Let's check in here. No, I don't see any. Sometimes they hide in the grass or the seaweed. Nope. Son of a bitch, I know there's another way to get oil. I think you gotta go deep down in the ocean, though, and we're not ready for that. Oh, there's a couple right there. Let's get them. Let's not use the shotgun. Get up on the beach, bitch. There's another one down here. Let's go get it. So yeah, you get chitin, oil, silica pearls, of course raw meat, and occasionally black pearls from these things. Now I don't know what the black pearls are used for, but I gotta imagine they'll come in handy at some point. You know, another way to get oil and all sorts of other shit is by murdering these tech dinos. I think you can get like electronics and stuff from them, which we're actually gonna need to craft a generator. Which I was thinking we might craft in the next episode, so let's eat some tech ass. Look at this, another explorer note. Finding all sorts of these today. Nice, yeah, I don't really care what the note says. I just want my levels. Four of them. Let's go wait, wait, wait. Stamina. All right, we got enough oil. 
Plenty more chitin, whole bunch of silica pearls. All is good. Let's head home. Ah, uh, there are the redwoods. Start heading in that direction. And at some point, I would like to get down deep into the ocean and explore it further. I mean, if we're gonna quote unquote conquer the island, we definitely gotta explore the ocean. So that's gonna involve crafting scuba gear, which I'm not sure what's involved there yet. I haven't looked into that. And we're definitely gonna wanna tame like a megalodon. N not megalodon, Meg megadon, those big fucking sharks. We're gonna wanna tame one of those, and I have no idea how to do that yet. I gotta imagine it involves crafting a boat first. So I'll look into all that shit at some point. But right now, I just want to kind of finish getting our base put together. I want to, um, you know, craft a few more things. Like I said, a generator, a refrigerator, which is just like a preserving bin, except it works a lot better than a preserving bin. So we still got a lot of work done uh, or left to do uh, at the base. And then we can look into uh, maybe going after the... What the fuck? Oh my god, I can't move. I can't do anything. I'm fucking stuck. You little piece of shit. Oh, come on. What the fuck? All right, here we go. Come here, you little bastard. What the hell was that? I was like paralyzed. Is Dora paralyzed too? Why am I stabbing this piece of shit? I have a shotgun. Yeah, how'd that feel, motherfucker? There's nothing left. He's disintegrated. Oh, no, wait. Is that the body all the way over here? Yeah. Little fuck. What the hell was I even talking about? <laughs> <laughs> that shit always happens to me. All right. Um, let's eat something, because we're just about starving. Let's get the hell out of here. Um, oh, the ocean. Yeah, at some point, we'll definitely explore the ocean. I know there are caves down in the ocean, which we're definitely going to explore caves at some point as well. And, of course, I would like to fight a boss or two. Once we do all those things and explore the map a little bit further... Then we'll just see where this series goes from there. We might wrap it up at that point and jump into a new map. I know I've seen some people say Scorched Earth is the next map to play after the island, but we don't necessarily have to go in order. Maybe I'll run a poll and see which map you guys want to see me play next. Okay, let's grab some hide. And we're going to need some wood also. And let's get the hide and the oil and the wood into the forge, and that will refine and magically create gasoline. Now, the first thing I want to do here is, well, I guess spend this level real quick. Let's go fortitude. Um, I want to put these two foundations right here. Bam, bam. And now I want to craft the spiral staircase, which should go up to the rooftop from that platform, but we need more wood in order to craft that. Oh, the beaver's got a level. Whoops. Let's go, uh, wait. And let's go get some more wood. It's pretty ridiculous how quick this beaver gets encumbered. We should have tried to tame a higher level. That fucking thing's gonna want to fight us, isn't it? Oh, shit, it's coming for us. Let's go. Ow. Fucking thing. What is that, a uh, honey badger? Honey badger's eating my ass. Let's go in the water. See if he can swim as good as we can. Still behind us? I don't know. Let's go through this gateway. Oh, didn't mean to hop off. That's okay. Oh, he's back there. We're good. Get inside. All right, you chill right there, Bev. Let's close this gate. All right. Uh, yeah, so that kind of sucks. I wish we had a higher level beaver. We don't. Maybe we can just work on leveling Bev up and just dump all the points into weight. Or uh, we go out and find a uh, better beaver. For now let's go kill that fucking honey badger. Oh, it's at the gate. Let's just give it the fucking shotgun. Alright, let's put the spiral staircase in right here. Just like that. Beautiful. Alright, now we're gonna put a doorway right here with a door. 
And then we're gonna put window walls up around uh, there. So let's grab a bunch of wood, make the door frame, the door, and as many windows as we can. We ran through that wood real fast. Throw this poop in the garden. And uh, let's take Neebs this time. Yeah, let's take Neebs. I'll do the chopping of the trees. Neebs will just get us there and carry some of the wood. Look how fucking foggy it is. Holy shit, I can't see anything. I'm going to leave all this open for now because I'm not sure how I'm going to build this. I think I might go up a level here because we got the gateway right there. And then over, I don't know. I got to figure all that out. So for now, we'll just leave it all open. Oh, that's going to piss me off right there. I got to fix that. That's better. Fuck, there's an Alpha Raptor over there. We should go take care of it before it finds its way over here and starts tormenting my dinos. We'll take Neebs. Hey there, I hate to interrupt your meal, but I feel like I have to murder you as a precautionary measure. Man, that thing was fucking tough. And it was only a level 16 alpha. What the hell? Look at all this prime meat. Where's all the stuff? Oh, okay, I got the stuff already. Some cloth pants. Some arrows. Another uh, skull mask. Alright. At least it's dealt with. Because like I said, it would have just made its way over to our camp. Would have ate our beaver. You know raptors love eating beaver. Alright guys, that's going to be it for this episode. I am going to do some more resource gathering tonight. More wood, more stone. I may start upgrading more of the base to stone, but I won't do any more building until, uh, you know, the next episode or whatever. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and I hope you're looking forward to seeing more. Thank you so much for watching and all of the support. It really does mean a lot. You guys can follow me on Instagram or Twitter. It's at Glock9Gamer. I follow all gamers back. Stick around for more ARC, and I will catch you guys in the next episode.